Bonjour. So, our today Vietnamese lesson is going to have a little bit of français. So today we're going to look at 10 Vietnamese clothing words which borrow from the French language. Before we begin, I'm terribly sorry if I accidentally butchered the French language. It's not my intention. I'm just bad at it. First one, a code. And anyone who knows French might have guessed it. Ao, mang, to. Ao, mang, to. In French, le manteau. Example in Vietnamese. Mai trời lạnh. Con nhớ mặc áo măng tô cho ấm. Tomorrow, it will be cold. Remember to wear a coat for warmth. Again, mai trời lạnh. Con nhớ mặc áo măng tô cho ấm. Now we have a coat. Let's go to shirt. In Vietnamese, we call it áo sơ mi. Áo sơ mi. French, la chemise. One example in Vietnamese. Nhiều công ty yêu cầu nhân viên mặc áo sơ mi khi đi làm. Nhiều công ty yêu cầu nhân viên mặc Áo sơ mi khi đi làm. Many companies require employees to wear shirt when going to work. Now, it's not like we go to work naked, but shirt to us are shirts with colors. These colors. Yep, so many companies require employees to wear shirt with colors to work. Again, so the word for shirt is ao se mi. Third one. This one is the one that guys often wear under their se mi. <laughs> This is a an undershirt in Vietnamese we call it ao mai o Ao, mai, o. French, le meilleur de corps. One example. Ở Việt Nam, vào mùa hè, có nhiều người mặc áo mai ô ra đường. In Vietnam, summer, there are many people who wear an undershirt outside. So, this is very common between middle-aged men. Younger people, yeah, less likely to see it. So, again, for the undershirt, ao, mai, o. Mm. This one, we're going to top to inside. This one uh, is Su chiêng, su chiêng, le su chiêng ho. I know I butchered that one. Okay, one example in Vietnamese. Ở nhà, ai mặc su chiêng làm gì? Ở nhà, ai mặc su chiêng làm gì? At home. Who the hell wear bra at home? <laughs> Something like that. So this is a rhetorical question. It's like, who in their right mind wear bra at home? Something like that. So again, the word for bra. Su chiêng. Number five. Something under. This one. Si lip. Si lip. Sip. Sip. For French, le sleep. So, 
I don't know how this diverse into two words, but basically that's how we use it now. Example. Con gái mặc xì lip. Con con trai mặc xì. Con gái mặc xì lip. Con con trai mặc xì. Okay, so this one is rather a, a definition rather than example. Girls wear silly and guys wear sip. Again, silly sip. Next, now we're going to accessories. This one. Boat. Boat. French. Le boat. One example. Đi boat nóng lắm. Đi boat nóng lắm. It's so hot to wear boots. So, if it's hot to wear boots, what are we going to wear? So, instead of boat, we're going to wear sang dan. Yes, you heard it correctly. It's sang dan. So, when you go online shopping, you're going to see both versions, like the French, not the French, sorry, the English writing of the word and the Vietnamese. But when we say it, we always say sang dan. Sang dan. For French, I guess, is les sandales. Example. Hè rồi, đi sang đàn cho mát chân. Hè rồi, đi sang đàn cho mát chân. It's summer. Let's wear some sandal <laughs> to have a cool feet. That's what Vietnamese say. I'm doing direct translation. <laughs> so, okay. Sang dan. Sang dan. Next. We go bottom to hands. Hands. Gang. Gang. For French, I guess, kind of similar. Leon. Example. Trời lạnh đấy. Con nhớ mang găng tay đi. Trời lạnh đấy. Con nhớ mang găng tay đi. It's cold. Remember to bring gloves with you. Okay, again. Găng. Găng. Hands. Now neck things. Again, we have two versions. Cà vạt. Cà vạt. Cà vạt. Cà vạt. Cà vạt. Cà vạt. For French, la cravate. Example. Anh có nên mặc vét đeo cà vạt đi xin việc không nhỉ? Anh có nên mặc vét đeo cà vạt đi xin việc không nhỉ? Should I wear a suit and tie for um job interview? Okay. Anh có nên mặc vest đeo cà vạt đi xin việc không nhỉ? Yeah, it depends, I think. Now, last but not least, something cute. Something both men and women use. No. Okay. No. French is le ne. I guess. <laughs> Example. Ai tặng anh cái nơ ấy đây? Ai tặng anh cái nơ ấy đây? Who gave you that bow? Kidnap my cat.
You can go. <laughs> no. So, this is the list of the words we studied today. Ao mang to. Ao mang to. Ao sơ mi. Ao sơ mi. Ao may o. Ao may o. Su chiêng. Su chiêng. Si lip. Sip. Si lip. Sip. Bốt. Bốt. Sang đan. Sang đan. Găng. Găng. Cà vạt. Cà vạt. Cà vạt. Cà vạt. Nơ. Nơ. That's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Me, I had a ton of fun making it. And if you don't mind, could you please leave down in the comment what your mother tongue is and did you find any common things between your mother tongue and the Vietnamese language? Au revoir!